Okay, this is uh, Kurt and Kate in Kate's car. I'm going to do a little uh, revisit an issue we talked about in the past, do a little rotary etiquette. So here we go. Let's do it. Okay, what is this road called? We're on East we Street. are on East Main Street approaching the stop sign going by Paradiso Financial and Insurance Services and heading up to Stafford Savings Bank. And we're going to take this we're at stopped. all different angles, right? Okay. Let me check on the air. If we get to the stop sign before the people from Furnace Avenue, we have the right of way. Okay. And we have to watch for cars coming straight through that way okay. to Furnace Avenue. Okay, now, so now I'm going to take a left here. I'm going to show everyone how to okay, do this. Okay, here's a yield sign. So we have to yield to anybody that's in the rotary. We're in the rotary first. Here we go. Very Around. nice and easy. And going now, down Route 32. Let me turn around. We're especially doing this for Jess Burnash, who had a serious issue with us this morning. And because she's such a loyal fan of ours, we decided we'd do this for her. All right, this is good. If these people let me go. I mean, should we get live with Kate and Kurt stickers for our cars? I think we should. That would be bad. Oh, and good. We got a pedestrian. Okay, and now we're coming northbound on Route 32, entering the rotary. Now, Remember, always stop for pedestrians in the crosswalk. You're welcome. Okay, so another yield sign. Oh, now okay, look at someone's this. Someone's already in. We haven't reached the lines yet, so it's there right away. We look both ways. Now, what We're about in this the part? rotary. He has to wait for us. We're already in the rotary. Thank you very He much. stopped appropriately, and we're on our way. That was easy. It is easy. Now, we'll take it from one more angle. 34 seconds? Yeah, we okay, can. shut it. Stop it. Okay, and we're going to stop for the youth that's almost in the crosswalk. We're hitting a yield here. Okay, we're coming up to the white line in the road. Okay, there's someone already in the rotary. They're going that way. We're there next, and we have the right of way. And off we go. And that's how you do it. Simple. That's Great the driving, Kate. Thank you, as always. And you're welcome, Jess Burnash. <laughs> you better get it right. <laughs> Hey everyone, it's live with Kate and Kurt. We are here at Staffordville Lake. Uh, hopefully you can see behind us. There's a nice little crowd here and we've got rough going on. Let's get straight to the news because there is a lot to do. Um, the first thing I want to talk, this is actually very urgent. Um, on August 7th, a couple days ago, a raccoon was euthanized after having contact with two dogs in the Conklin and Pine Road area. The raccoon was submitted for rabies and tested positive. So please make sure, no matter what part of Stafford you're in, that uh, you always check for animals during the day, um, suspicious looking animals. Um, call Animal Control for anything at 684-2382 and obviously call 911. Okay. All right, uh, we have the second annual Hockey Legends Night coming up featuring Boston Bruins alumni, Terry O'Reilly, Reggie Lemelin, Rick Mid Middleton, and LB, Lyndon Byers. Um, all proceeds benefit the Stafford High School United Hockey Co-op team. Uh, the tickets will include dinner, a meet and greet and picture with the players, autographs, uh, $5 for two items, so that's a good deal, raffles, silent, and live auctions. So it's gonna be great. It's gonna be Saturday, September 10th, 4 p.m. to 8 p.m. at the Fairgrounds Restaurant at Stafford Motor Speedway. Kids are $45, or adults are $45. Kids um, 12 and under are $30. It's a great event. Um, make sure you go out. Uh, if you have any questions, call Michelle Salou at, yeah, <laughs> at 860-729-0690. SafeNet Ministries is offering breakfast and beyond to all schools. Snack at the First United Methodist Church next to the Food Center or at the Pavilion at Staffordville Lake from 9 to 10 a.m. on Monday, Wednesday, and Friday from the weeks of the 15th to the 22nd. The program is provided due to generous donations supporting the SafeNet Ministries. Uh, donations of foods, goods, or money can be sent to PO Box 93, Stafford Springs, or dropped off at 86 Main Street. Uh, if you have any questions, please call 851-9987. Is it me or did the sun just, it just totally came out. burst on the scene? It's hot up here. It's getting hot. Alright, I'm going to that one. Uh, 
like to announce um, the Stafford Crusaders reunion, September 24th, 2 to 6 p.m. at the American Legion in Stafford. If you are planning on attending, we need to know as soon as possible. Please send an email to Terry Galicia at gmail.com. Can we, we can roll that? We can roll that as well. Okay, and uh, we we have had some great response thus far, and do want do not want to leave anybody out. So make sure you get in touch with Terry and head on down to the Crusaders reunion. The second annual Tina Nowinski Memorial Golf Tournament, we're going to mention this every single week, is Friday, September 9th. They are desperately looking for sponsors. We know that because of the economy, it's very difficult for people to uh, lend the extra money. But um, if you can, please get in contact with Jerry or Meg Nowinski. Um, I will list their phone numbers as well. Um, and just so you know, all the proceeds do go to the Lucas Foundation, and this is a great catch right off. It is. It's just great all, all across all the board. Together. Um, Starting next week, we're going to have our own little sports, well, I don't know if I want to call them little. Uh, <laughs> Truck Barrels is going to be our sportscaster starting next week, but um, this will be the last week I'm going to do the honors. So I'd like to give a shout out to J.J. Hill for winning the late model feature right from right here in Stafford, a graduate. I think, did he go to Stafford High? Did he go? I think he did. I believe so, yeah. I used to work with his father, Jack, um, over at the Sheriff's Department. And uh, great, great guy, great kid. Um, congratulations, JJ, on your first victory of the year. Keep up the good work. Good job. All right. There'll be a race uh, this Friday night at Stafford Motor Speedway. And uh, head on down there. There'll be a makeup race from the June race. So there'll be two SK modified features and a continuation of the modified um, tour or something like that. So head on down. <laughs> they'll be good. That's enough. That's good. Okay. All right, so let's head up to Mill Pond Store to Taka with the weather. Hey, Kurt, we are up here at Mill Pond Store with Taka. So, Taka, tell us a little bit about the weather. Well, today is going to be uh, one of the days. It's a hit and miss deal today. Um, we may get rain this afternoon. We may not. Uh, it's going to come through the state. Uh, I know, Kate, you got a softball game tonight. You've been trying to get in a, uh, what, a championship round or something? We're in the tournament, yeah. They're in the tournament, <laughs> and uh, I think you'll get it in. Uh, it looks uh, hit and miss, but if it rains, it's going to be quick. It's going to pass quick. Uh, the next three days, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday, it's uh, do whatever you want uh, days. Uh, the weather's going to be beautiful, sunny, low 80s, no humidity. Uh, but then again, here comes Sunday now, and Sunday I think, uh, get it done the three days before. Uh, it's uh, going to be a complete washout, I believe, on Sunday. It'll carry a little bit into Monday, it'll clear for Monday and Tuesday, and uh, uh, so there you go. Uh, you know, get it done uh, before Sunday. Okay. Okay. And, uh, wow. Well, yeah, so it looks pretty good. Good. Yeah. Well, I mean, yeah. we can't complain about that. No. You know? Hey, Taka, do the birthdays. Oh, we got some wing dingers here. Okay. <laughs> um, David Collado this week, the young kid. Uh, Shelly Clapper, Stacy Beebe, uh, Samantha Woodrow, Sue Messier, uh, Rich uh, Shuck, Candy Sullivan, and Marilyn Mohat. Uh, lives just up the road here. Okay. Um, I just want to, uh, one little thing, uh, last week I was in here and Kate did a little fill in for me which was appreciated, but I just want to thank all you people out there for your thoughts and prayers. Um, during the rough time, uh, I lost my brother-in-law, as you all know, that uh, Sonny Hipsky out of Wellington and we went through a rough period of time, still are, but I want to thank you for your thoughts and prayers uh, during that rough time. Thank you very much. Thanks, Doc. Back to you, Kurt. That was awesome. Yeah. That was great. As yeah. always, Taka, thank you. And good luck tonight, Kate, in your yeah. softball game. Thank you very much. Big game tonight. I would hope that everybody could come up. Are you going to come up to the game? I have to, I have to coach football oh. down on Olympic Field. Maybe when that's over, I'll bring the kids up and watch. Good game tonight. Um, like I said, middle school, 630. It's going to be against Mike Petrol and uh, West Hall women's softball. It's a big game tonight. Yeah. It should be fun. Good yeah. luck. Thank you very much. Uh, anything right. else? No. Great week, That's beautiful great. day here up at Staffordville Beach. It's a public beach for any Stafford residents, so come on up anytime. Um, great rec program, so yep. next year take advantage of it. And that's it. Awesome. Until next week, a pleasure, always. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs>
you see? <laughs> oh my god. Just a little quick special segment with uh, Stephen Dusa. Stephen, where are you going to school next year? Uh, Nichols College. Nichols College. What's your major? Uh, sport management and law. Oh, that's good. It should be fun. Stephen was a legend at Stafford High School. Still is. Uh, still is. Um, and, it, and it helps us do instruction down at Dance Visions, right in downtown Stafford. It's at Two River Road. Yep. Yep. Upstairs. So you still gonna be doing that? Yep. Every Tuesday. Every Tuesday. So. If you want any information on Dan's business, what's their phone number? 684-3688. 684-3688. Good luck in school, Steve. We'll see you next week. <laughs>